Jason Halloran was on pole position for the first British Superbike race of the weekend at Cadwell Park with Kyle Ride in second and the pair jostled for P1 on the opening lap. Good starts also for the two Hawk racing Honda riders of Charlie Nesbitt and Lee Jackson whilst Ryan Vickers was in trouble. A mechanical and almost a collision meant he had to park up his Yamaha. Tommy Bridewell from 12th on the grid was doing a fine job, a good start. And Heading into the top six, this point getting through on Leon Haslam. Lee Jackson then made a move on his teammate, Charlie Nesbitt, to move up into third place with Glenn Irwin in hot pursuit. Jason Halloran, carrying a hand injury, started to fade as the race went on. Lee Jackson then moving up into second place and putting in the fastest lap of the race to boot. Jason O'Halloran tried to fight on and hang on to the podium positions. And in the meantime, in the background, it was Bridewell versus Irwin all over again, and this one rumbled on all the way down the hill and into the chicane. Jackson went through on O'Halloran, but then as the battle between Irwin and Bridewell continued, Nesbitt went through on O'Halloran up into the top three, and Bridewell tried to hunt the pack down for a podium. This was a bit of a... A cheeky moment from Glenn Irwin as he made a move on Tommy Bridewell, putting him onto the grass. Bridewell bounced back again to go through on his old championship rival and teammate, but he wasn't able to fight for the podium. In the end, Tommy Bridewell going through on Jason O'Halloran to get fourth place, but it was the two Hawk racing Honda riders that would take the final podium positions. Glenn Irwin got through on O'Halloran on the final lap as well to get himself a top five. Bridewell nearly threw it all away, clipping the grass on the exit of the chicane. But it was Kyle Ride that was victorious from Lee Jackson and Charlie Nesbitt.